IQ9 gives you the ability to add custom languages. You can do this by navigating to the Help menu. From there, go down to Languages. As you can see, IQ already comes with a few languages by default. You can edit these languages, however, we are going to add a new language. Click Translation Utility to open the Language Editor. From here, you can see that you can choose the language you are translating from and the language you are translating to. You can see the pre-existing languages are here and you can choose to edit them. Click New under the Translation To option and set the native language and the language name in English and set the fallback language for the words and phrases you do not want to change. IQ will then notify you that it has saved the language file. Now we just translate the words and phrases we want to change by clicking the corresponding row location in the New Language column. In this case, the column labeled Latin. You can use the Find box to locate a specific word or phrase you want to change. In this case, we want to change the Backup and Restore menu title. Click the Save button when you are finished editing your new language. By clicking the Show in Folder button, you can see that the new language file is saved inside a folder within IQ named Translations. To demonstrate how easy it is to move the new language to a different installation of IQ, we have moved the file from the IQ Translations folder and onto our desktop. Now you can see that there is no Latin language located in the languages list. You can easily drag the language file into IQ and see that Latin has been automatically added into the languages list. Now when we look at the backup and restore utility, we can see that the title has been changed into Latin. You can go back into the translation utility and edit the new custom language to your preference at any time.